All right, B6 delay, B6 booster. Try and get a straight run out of this. We'll try and get you a nice, nice shot right here. Smoke to the face. Let's do this. Let's get right behind it here. Not really going to see where it goes, but this would be a fun shot. Let's back up just a little so you can see the horizon a little bit more. Take a look behind me. No one's coming. <laughs> All right, here we go. B6, B6. In five, four, three, two, one. Oh, hit the wall again. Same spot. There's the explosion. A little bit of a tailwind, so I'm not expecting these cars to go very far today, unfortunately. Look at that beeping dust, kind of annoying. All right, see you at the car. Right, off we go, off we go. It might be about the same distance as the last run. Let's find out. You hit the wall right about here. See the dirt displaced right there. And whoop. Well, not quite. 186.11. 186 feet, 11 inches. Uh, about the same damage. A little bit of suspension damage in there. Yeah, not a lot. A couple of rocks on the nose right there. The racks are hauled up. Let's slide this car to the side. You can see where it burned. Look at that, man. Whew. I guess they call that the reverse charge. They have a late reverse charge on these delay motors, and that's designed for the parachute. And it leaves quite a mark on the ground. And also inside the car, there's two little red rods right in the middle in here. There's two little circular pieces. They're supposed to be gray. You can see they're burnt black pretty badly. These yellow pieces here should be yellow, of course, and they're black as well. Oh, these cars get pretty dirty. These pieces get replaced regularly. It's all part of the fun that rear axles get burnt, too. Look at that. All right, let's keep them coming.